In order to improve anything, you have to measure it. So when we started to look at adaptability as a key component that everybody's saying, ah, oh, this is the thing, this is what we need to, to unlock and understand to thrive in the future. I have a different methodology to assess startup founders, and it's not complicated. I look for signs of one specific trait. Not IQ, not EQ. It's adaptability. How well a person reacts to the inevitability of change, and lots of it. Adaptability itself is a form of intelligence, and our adaptability quotient, or AQ, is something that can be measured, tested, and improved. The whole concept of AQ, of adaptability quotient, we broke it down into three areas, ability, character, and environment. So AQ ability is how and to what degree do I adapt? It's a choice. Many people don't realize it's a choice, but I think it's a choice about how not only you want to react to certain situations, but what kind of people you want to surround yourself with. AQ character, it's who adapts and why. Some people will adapt because they're motivated by big goals, by growth, by achievement. While the others will adapt because I have to adapt. It's a duty. I must, otherwise I will lose my job. And you are actually not bad because you adapt perhaps in a very systematic way. It's just your character. But your manager must know about that. AQ environment is about when does somebody adapt and to what degree. People spend two-thirds of their time in the office working. If they have a frustrating experience, a depressing experience, an experience that sucks when they have to go to work, then probably their life will be impacted in the same way. We're at the ground, you know, 0.1 of assessment and measure. And we do it through a conversational chatbot. So you'll have a 25 minute, half an hour conversation. Uh, we're working to get that as natural as possible. And you will then get a score, uh, so an AQ score. And you also get a bit of a profile. But taking that data only shows you that snapshot. What we're super excited about is, can we predict what might happen next? A reskill index or a change readiness of that team or cohort or workforce so that we can then put interventions in place for those that might struggle, aren't quite ready, so that we're using our resources effectively. I think adaptability is one of those essential skills for the future. You gotta have great IQ, you gotta have EQ, but if you don't have your AQ now for the future, you're not gonna stand out. You set your mindset towards it as you learn and build that muscle. Um, it's something that everyone needs to focus on through life.